Now, let's talk about the other fight uh, that happened. It's uh, Alexa Grasso versus Valentina Shevchenko. So these are the women. And this fight actually lasted um, at least five rounds. So in the first round, Grasso opens with an early strike with um, Shevchenko, who quickly lands a left hand and secures a takedown. Shevchenko press pressures Grasso on the ground as Grasso looks for a submission, but none of her attempts are successful. The round ends with Shevchenko in control, scoring 10 to 9. Then comes the second round, where Shevchenko lands some solid strikes early before taking Grasso down. Grasso attempts a submission from her back, but Shevchenko remains safe. The round follows a similar pattern to the first, with Shevchenko keeping Grasso on the ground and preventing any significant offense, winning 10 to 9 and extending her lead to 20 to 18. Now, third round. Both fighters stay on their feet for the first two minutes, with Grasso landing a few lefts before Shevchenko secures a, a takedown. Shevchenko maintains top control for most of the round, preventing Grasso from mounting any significant offense. The round ends with Shevchenko holding dominant ground control, leading 30 to 27. Fourth round, Shevchenko opens with a body kick, followed by a head kick attempt with which Grasso deflects. Grasso ends up on her back, trying for a guillotine choke, holding on for over two minutes before Shevchenko escapes. Shevchenko, who attempted her own um, submission, but, you know, Grasso was able to evade that. The challenger remains a dominant in top position, winning another 10 to 9 round, leading 40 to 36 overall. Then the final round, fifth round. Grasso begins aggressively, but Shevchenko controls the distance and dominates uh, the early exchanges, aiming to reclaim her title. Grasso successfully defends against uh, a takedown and clinches with uh, Shevchenko. After a brief scramble, Shevchenko lands a one-two punch combination and pushes Grasso against the cage. Shevchenko secures another takedown, but can't hold the position for long. The round ends with Shevchenko executing a hip toss in the center of the octagon, dominating the round. The official decision is unanimous victory for Shevchenko 50 to 45 on all cards. And that is all we got for you right now. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.